Today in the camping channel, we're looking at a car that's making waves in the affordable car market. But the Dacia Jogger Hybrid is a car with a twist, because it's available with a kit that transforms it into a mini camper. Keep watching to find out more. Hi folks, I'm Ian, the camping editor at outandaboutlive.co.uk and today I'm out and about with this Dacia Jogger. Uh, now you might be wondering why a camping editor is reviewing a car. Well, this is no ordinary car. It's actually a camping car and it's uh, fitted out with everything you need to turn it into what they describe as a mini camper van. So I'm going to have a look at it, set it up and see uh, how it goes. So here it is, the sleep pack that converts the jogger into a mini camper. It includes a folding mattress that fits perfectly in the rear and it's all really easy to set up. Push the front seats forward, flatten the back seats, release the catch, then fold out the bed frame. Unfold the base and pull out the side slats, then slide the mattress into place and you've got your double bed. The rest of your camping gear can be stored inside the specially fitted box and only takes a few seconds to roll out your sleeping bag. I've just set up a single here but there is just about enough room for two. You also have the option of adding these blackout window blinds for more privacy. Now you could just leave it at that but if that all looks a little bit cramped you can add a rear tailgate tent to the sleep pack and that will give you additional living and sleeping space. Now I've been pitching tents for many many years and I have to admit this was more difficult than usual so do practice first before heading out. I got there in the end though and as you can see it adds a lot of extra accommodation to your setup. So that's the camping part but what about the car itself? Well first and foremost like all Dacia cars the Jogger is great value for money. This fully equipped automatic comes in at under 24,000, which is a fantastic price for a car of this size and spec. It uses a 1.6 litre petrol engine, which is paired with an electric motor, making it Dasher's first hybrid model. Inside, the Jogger might feel a little bit plasticky, but it's fitted with pretty much everything the modern driver would expect, including hill start assistance, a reverse camera, and front and rear parking sensors. Cruise control, blind spot warnings, and an 8 inch multimedia display with DAB and Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. There's keyless entry, automatic windscreen screen wipers, heated door mirrors, plus air conditioning. Everything you'd want in a car, really. Now, the Jogger is certainly not an off-road vehicle, nor does it pretend to be, but it does cope perfectly well when you leave the tarmac to negotiate bumpy campsites. On the road, the Jogger Hybrid feels smooth and responsive. The automatic transmission makes city driving a breeze and the regenerative braking helps recharge the battery while you drive. And no, it's not built for speed, but for families and adventurers, it's perfectly adequate. Now let's talk about price. The Dacia Jogger Hybrid starts at around 22,500 in the UK and this fully spec model is 23,645. The sleep pack, including the camping box and mattress, will add 1,565 to the total cost and the tent and blackout windows are another 537. So you're looking at 25,745 in total for this fully equipped version. For a hybrid with this level of versatility and all the camping setup, that's actually great value, especially when you compare it to the cost of a camper van. But is this really a serious alternative option to a camper? So what's the verdict? Is this a realistic alternative to a camper van? Well, yes and no. Uh, let's get one thing straight. This is not a camper van and nothing like it. It's basically a bed in the back of a family car. Now, that's fine as far as it goes uh, but the, remember there's no cooker there's no sink no toilet so you will need facilities of some sort or have to make alternative arrangements of some sort uh, the other issue you're going to have is that a lot of campsites don't actually allow you to sleep in the car so that's something you have to take into consideration if you're looking for somewhere you can just pull over you can set it up in no time at all and uh, have a sleep and then get up and go in the morning then this could actually be what you're after Overall, the Dacia Jogger Hybrid with the sleep pack is an affordable, practical option for anyone who loves a bit of adventure. It's not just a car, it's a lifestyle choice. And if you're after something efficient, spacious and ready for road trips, the Jogger Hybrid is definitely worth considering. 
hope that video was useful for you. If it was, then hit the like button and uh, leave a comment down below. Tell us what you think about the tent if you uh, would like to. Uh, you can also uh, subscribe to the channel and uh, make sure you don't uh, miss any of our videos. Uh, make sure you switch on the notifications and you'll be uh, letting know when there's a new video available. In the meantime, happy camping. <laughs>